sometimes the types of physical altercations that young people, teens, young teens, preteens, have to deal with isn't a severe situation. It can be more along the lines of bullying, people putting their hands on you when you don't want them to put your hands on you. And so it's not a pro always appropriate to punch someone in, in all situations or to, or to really harm someone in all situations. One of the things that young people might deal with is someone shaking your, kind of like shaking your hand, but they're squeezing it really hard and they're hurting your hand. One of the things is that, that you can do first off to try to protect yourself is, is not to let them, if you can help it, not to let them grab your fingers when you do a handshake. Like uh, when they grab, they'll, you know, they get you here. When you, when you shake someone's hand, someone's hand, you want to go as far back into the grip as you can. You want to hold it towards the back of their hand so they can't, it makes it hard for them to hurt you or grip your, or grip your fingers. Sometimes people have a tendency to squeeze really hard with handshakes just because, and they're not even realizing it. So that's the first thing. But the second thing, if you find yourself hurt, they won't let go or it's hurting your hand. One of the simple things you can do in the hand, it's pretty sensitive in the bones of the hand and in between the hand here. And if you take, take a knuckle, your middle knuckle, your first knuckle, and you take it and you grind it back and forth, you press and grind it back and forth that can often make them enough to make them let go and you haven't seriously hurt them. Obviously you could say, you're hurting me, let go of my hand, not letting go. Just take it and grind it right in there like that. Hope that helps. Just my thoughts. Let me know what you have to think.